Hi everyone, welcome to the Stitch and Post. I'm Nancy, this is Knitting with Nancy, and I'm here with Trish today to introduce one of our newest yarns that we brought in for fall, and it is a chunky yarn by Manos called Cardo, and it is new for them as well. It's a really pretty, these are tonals, it's 100% Coradale wool. It retails for $25.30, and you get approximately 109 yards. So it's great for hats, vests, scarves, sweaters. And what I wanna to show today is a sweater sample that I'm making for the store. And I picked it because it's a really unique sweater in how it's made. It is top down. It starts with a tubular cast on for the neck. They tell you how to do it. The pattern name is Letty. It is available on Ravelry. You can also use the cast on bind off book, which a lot of you know that I love from Capsis. And it also explains how to do a tubular cast on. It is not a hard cast on. I actually really like it, but it makes and if I can showcase this, it makes it like a rolled edge that just rolls over the top and gives you a really nice neckline. So this is a top-down sweater. Why I like this yarn for it, one, it's squishy and it feels good, but this pattern is more of a mock cable. When I picked the pattern, I actually thought I was gonna be doing cables and I really like cables. But this is a wrap stitch pattern. So you're pulling the yarn in and wrapping it around four stitches. It gives a really nice effect on it. It's kind of a, like I said, a mock cable. Again, this is top down. So what you're looking at is the yoke and then you separate for the sleeves. Now, as you can see, I'm using my Cocoa Knits markers, which I really like because they work well. You can buy them separate or you could buy the Flight of Stitch markers, which I also use because I use the triangle ones for the beginning of the round. So I really like that as well as, and I'm gonna pull this one out real quick if I can. I forgot to tell Trish. I use the split ring markers so I can show the front of my work, which is interesting on this sweater because when I brought it in, someone said, well, what's the front? Because of where the beginning of the round is, goes here, but then you're switching it to a side seam. So it really helps in marking where the front is. I also, as those know, I love my stitch stoppers for it. Now, this is a quick knit. They say that it's a weekend knit. This is about two and a half days for me knitting and not full days. I'm talking a couple of hours um, each day. So not a lot. The most important thing to do though is to check your gauge. Because if you don't and you're off, your sweater will be either way too big or way too small, none of which you will be happy with. Um, again, I use my maker's board that we sell here. Those who know, I love it. I also love the Chow Gu needle set. Now this is the four inch tip set. And the reason why this one works really well on top down sweaters is because you need a 16 inch to start at the neck which you get with the four inch tips, not the five inch tips. So that can go the entire sweater top to bottom. I'm using the five inch tips, so then I had to come and purchase separately a size 16 inch uh, cable, fixed cable to do it. Again, I love Chow Gu. This is our newest yarn. I hope you will enjoy it and that if you have any questions, you'll give me a call here at the Stitch and Post and come see the sample in a week or so. All done. Have a great day. Thanks for stay tuning in.